What's up, YouTube? I have a application that I'm about to do today. This is a wig that I recently colored. I did record the color um, off of live. So I'm going to show you guys an easy technique to do that color. Let me get my other... Um, let me get my other socials up so that we can get started. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? We're going to start this live application. Brother. What's up? What's up? Hey, April. Let me get my little lotion on. I'm always jumping on here with no lotion. We're about to do this application on this wig unit that I just colored. I'm also going to show you guys like what to do, how to get this, how I got this color. What's up? What's up? I'm early today. I'm early today. I'm early. I'm early. I'm early. Let me get my other socials up. Hold on one second, y'all. Let's get on these other socials so we can get started on this application. This wig is so cute. This is going to be a part of the, uh, the new giveaway. I didn't separate the curls yet. So I'll do that with my fingers when I put it on. We're going to do a glue application. This is going to be a giveaway. Let me grab the, um, the box where the hair comes from. Let me grab that box so that y'all can see where it comes from. What did I do with it? Oh, my gosh. Oh, here we go. So this hair, lately, I've been telling y'all I'm I'm accepting hair, but my review on it is not going to be the end review. I'm going to be like, depending on you guys to do the review, the people that win the wig. It's a random giveaway. This hair is from I Define Natural, and it colored really good. Uh, the only thing they did tell me not to color it above a number 27. As you can see, I didn't go that high. It's probably like what you would consider like a 30. I didn't go that high up and I toned it. And I'm going to show y'all like a quick way to get these in here. Y'all going to be amazed. Like I got a like a quick way to get that color in there. And I'm going to help y'all out. Hold on. I'm trying to get my other socials up. Hold on, y'all. I'm messing up. One second, one second, one second, one second. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? What's up? I see you. I see you. I see you, Kayla. I see you. Hold on one second. Because half the time, I don't know what I'm doing up in here. Oh, I think I got it. Hold on. I got to put this thing up here for YouTube. I mean, not for YouTube. Yeah, hold on one second. I got to add the products that I'm going to be using. <clears throat> hold on, y'all. Let me see. What's up? I see you. I see you, Nicole. Ja'Kayla, I see you up in here. I see you. I see you. But yeah, this is the hair that this is going to be up for our next giveaway. It's random. I don't, I don't, just so y'all know, I don't pick the winner. My team kind of go in and randomly pick. I don't think I'm better put this thing on here. Hey, Tangela, Nicole. Okay, we got to get the other people up. Hold on, y'all. So this is the wig. I'm gonna. Uh, I want to take this wig cap off because I was supposed to show y'all like a new. I put this wig cap on with liquid gold, so I'm gonna take it off with just water and put another one on just for y'all, just for uh, so y'all can see the new wig cap. Everybody been talking about the HD caps. I'm gonna take this one off. And that's another thing, y'all. When y'all put these wigs on, y'all got to be super careful. People be snatching them off, and then they be like, my hair came out. Of course. That's what's going to happen. You have to be gentle. So this was just applied with liquid gold, but I want to put a fresh one on for y'all. So y'all can see the new cap. The new HD cap. I just did a post. What's up? What's up, niece? What's up, nephew? How y'all doing? What's up? Good afternoon. What's up, Dominique? I see you. I see you. 
I see you. What's up, Cody? Y'all up in here. I'm early. I'm early today. But I had this old wig cap on. I wanted to take it off because I wanted to put a new one on. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? We about to put this wig on. We about to. We got a wig giveaway. We got a wig giveaway. A wig giveaway. So I did um accept some hair. I'm not gonna review it. I will say that it was not hard to color. Um, I just put the curls in. I didn't like comb. I I, I like run my fingers through. This is gonna be our next wig giveaway. I recorded the uh, step by step on how to get this um, color technique. Super easy. Anybody can do it. You don't even have to be a hairstylist. But I'm gonna show you how to get this with the money pieces and the little halo in the back. I'm gonna show y'all how to do this. Like it's not gonna take you no time to do this uh, hair color. It'll almost look like a professional color. I'm gonna show y'all how to do it. But I'm gonna walk y'all through this application. That is the next wig we have up. Uh, I'm not going to really review it. The only thing I can say about the hair is it colored good, but they did say don't go, don't lift up higher than a 30. Just stay at under 27 or whatever. So that lets you know that the hair is probably going to last six months or less. Or you know what I'm saying? Like it's not ex um, expensive. So it's just something like if you just want to get some hair. And the lace, the lace on it was really nice. I actually... Um, I got a funny video to post y'all to post of this girl that actually had put it on me just to see how it do. And she was like so shocked. So this is the HD. You see how thin it is. You guys can get these on the website. We got them for like $2.50. You get two of them for $2.50. Or you can get, uh, I think uh, we got them on there. Like uh, you got a bundle. It got a bundle deal on there too. So go to the website, www.thehairdiagram.com. And you can get these thin caps. All right, so I'm going to do this application for this wig giveaway that we got coming up. And I'm actually going to, like I said, show y'all how to get. Oh, don't mess up my eyebrows. I got somewhere to go. Don't mess up the eyebrows. I'm going to be using our bowl hole liquid gold. Let me add that up here. Hold on, let me add it, let me add it. Hmm, come on now. All right, there we go. All right, so we got the bowl hole liquid gold. You can get it in an eight ounce or you can get it in a four ounce from our website at www.thehairdiagram.com. So we're about to get this on here, baby. This is install. It's going to be super, super easy. The hair is already curled. That is our next up for our giveaway. So let's get this baby on here. I can't see that good. Let me get a mirror because auntie is blind. We aging, honey. And the eyes is telling it all. Let me get my little mirror, honey, because I don't want to have my wig on crooked. I got somewhere to go, somewhere to be. All right. So you just going to take this liquid gold. The liquid gold is super safe. It does not contain any alcohol. It does not contain any DMDM. So it's safe for anybody to use. It is a liquid gel. It is not a glue. I know it holds like glue, guys, but it is not a glue. And that's what's so good about it. Super easy, super duper easy. Put this baby on here, put her on here, put her on here. Super easy. I think sometimes people say, oh, the liquid go. I like using a hairspray because it don't take that long. The hairspray, these uh, aerosol sprays are not safe, guys. So we want to stay away from that spraying it directly to the skin. But it's your body and you can do what you want to. It's your body. You can do what you want to. I'm just here to spread the news. Okay, you don't have to do what I say, but at least listen. But at least listen, niece. All right, so that's good enough. All right, so this takes about three to four minutes to dry. It don't take that long. It don't take that long. But you know what, y'all? Hold on. Y'all see how that ADHD be moving? I forgot to cut my ear out. I always cut that ear out because it's just going to help the cap lay flatter around that corner part, especially for y'all that have like them long sideburns. So you see how I cut it low down here by the earlobe? Do that. And then take it up. 
and around. And you see how I got that coverage right here? That's what you want. That's what you want. That's what you need. Oh, don't mess up my makeup. I got a show to go to. And I want to be cute. That means I'm going to have to redo my makeup around my edge, but that's okay. Hmm. All right, so this only takes like three or four minutes to dry. Like, talk to me, talk to me while I'm drying. It don't take that long. It don't take that long. It don't take that long. So don't cry. I know the hairspray is faster, but we're not doing hairspray. Once we learn, once we know better, we do better. We have the hair show already. We have your hair show already. No, we have a, I have a show uh, February the 11th. Then I'm going to be giving away all them, up, them half up, half down. When I come back from New York, everybody get one. You get one. You get one. I'm going to be like, open up in here. You get, a, you get a ponytail up there. This does not take long to die. does not take long to die. does not take long to die.
if you don't apply it right, it will flake. Just so you know, it will definitely flake. Because it's a gel, and gel, that's what gel do, but I pretty much try my best to show y'all what to do to keep that from happening, and if you're able to follow that step, you will see the benefits, like what she just commented. You will definitely see the benefits, and some stuff just take time, you know? Like, learning how to do something or use something you never used before, you just have to give it a chance. All right, so I'm cutting this in the inside because, like, I've been seeing, like, so many people... Um, like do this little thing i've been doing this little technique where you cut it so you don't have to cut the back now the wig is from i define natural okay i am not going to be giving y'all no full review on hair i'm not doing it i ain't never did it i'm not doing it so i'm gonna put the wig on one time and then i'm gonna give the wig away y'all can review it i can't review no wig that i'm not constantly wearing because that ain't right now it colored i will say it colored just fine but y'all gonna do the review. I already told y'all I'm not doing it because I'm. We already had one person. Oh, I was so upset. This company has sent me something, and they got bad customer service. That's why I don't like to. That it ain't just the just the hair. Sometimes it be people have bad customer service, so I don't want to be sending people to places and people not responding. Like one thing about us, don't test my customer service because we gonna respond. As long as it don't go to spam, we gonna respond regardless. I don't duck nothing but duct tape, baby. And that was a punchline for duct tape. So, no. I ain't been in business this long for nothing. And I didn't go in business to sell something because it's hot. This is what I do. This is what I love. Okay? It just so happened that I'm able, I, I able to have a career in something that I love. Okay? This ain't no, let me jump up and sell glue because it's hot. No, I've been doing hair replacement my whole career. Okay. Okay, we straight. And we on the same sheet of music. All right, so I'm just cutting this little piece off of here. I swear this is not, probably not a good spot, but we're going to make it happen. Oh, don't mess up my eyebrows. Just cut, 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 cut. And it can, the liquid gold, the good thing about the liquid gold, it can touch hair. It's just a liquid gel. It's not a glue. I don't like um, applying glue to my hairline. If you have just started watching me, you need to go check out my YouTubes. I talk about that all the time. Glue was made for skin. It was made for people. Just think about it. If glue is made for people who don't have hair, that means I'm not going to put glue on my real hair if I'm wearing for trim. Because it's a possibility that somebody cannot be as careful as the next person and take their hair out knowing that they was just wearing it for fun and not because they um, needed it. So we're just not going to even set ourselves up to take our hair out. They be like, the glue took my hair out. How? Why is it on your hair? That's my question. Why is it touching your hair? That's the only question we need to ask. Why is glue touching your hair? Oh, because the stylist wanted to make sure my cap didn't slide back. That's where the liquid gold come in at. Okay? Okay. Okay, boys and girls. We understand now, Auntie. We understand we know what you talk about, Auntie. We get it. We get it. But we're going to do what we want to do. <laughs> no, some people just don't know. And when you see something so much, or you see something being done, you think that that's the way that it go. That's all. All right. So I need to finish blending this down, like right here. I want this to lay a little flatter. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back on top with my liquid gold. Just a thin little, and I'm going to do it a section at a time because, I mean, even though I'm holding good right there where I'm at, I don't want it to lift or slide. So I'll dry this. It won't take long. The YouTube is the hair diagram. And 
And I really don't use makeup on my cap. So I just use my, um, I use my, uh, I use my lace tint. And usually I take my wig off daily. I mainly use the uh, glueless products unless I'm going out of town. Or if I do a Swiss lace, if I do a Swiss, let me tell you something. If I do a thicker lace, this is the wig that we're about to put on is HD. But if I do a Swiss lace, I don't care what's got, what I got going on. I'm going to always use glue. Okay? And I'm going to tell you why. That Swiss lace, you can hide the lace better with glue. Can hide the lace better when you uh use glue on swiss lace the lace is thick and you can hide it in the glue but um i mainly do a lot of hd i love swiss lace because it lasts longer thank you swiss lace lasts longer so it's just a matter of you choosing what's gonna fit your lifestyle you know people are like well which one is better which one is better now that's that totally depends on you as a person like your lifestyle how like if you're rough if you're careful like when you take care of your wigs and things like that but swiss lace is going to be the thicker lace okay i like both you found my channel Lee. Girl, I see you. I see you. I see you. All of our 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 winners that won a couple weeks ago, they've been putting their wigs on, and I kind of like asked them to like wait it out because I want to make sure that they, they give an honest review on these wigs. Because I'm not, I told y'all, I'm not reviewing no wigs. Mm -mm. Y'all not gonna have me on. Y'all not gonna have me on uh, Beyonce internet line of people talking about this. And no, um, I'm not doing no paid promo either. No. I can promo my own self. I can promo my own products. I'm not doing nothing. No, don't send if everything I get, I'm either gonna buy the wig myself or they can send it to me for free and I'll do the promo for free. But I'm not gonna sit up here and tell y'all whether the wig is good or not. Y'all gonna have to wait on the people that win the wig to tell y'all if it's good. All right, so I'm not gonna use makeup. I'm gonna use um my boho lace tint. Let me put that up here. Hold on real quick. I'm going to use my boho lace tint. I'm using the caramel for my skin tone. I got red undertone. Some people uh, mix it. Like we have a uh, caramel, light brown, medium brown, and dark brown. Some people mix it. Hold on. They may mix caramel with the uh, dark brown because they got like red undertones. Where is it? Hold on. I'm trying to put it up here for y'all. I don't see it. It's not up here. Okay, anyway, so you can get it on the website at www.thehairdiagram.com. All right, so I don't use makeup. Makeup is oil-based, and that can make your lace glue lift. Glue and oil is just not a good combination, okay? If I have to do, um, I kind of, I really stayed away from it. Once I learned when we were doing product development, I kind of, like, got more away from it when they were saying that, um, you know, to stay away from the aerosol directly on your skin. So, I just do my lace tint. It do fine. And I don't have to worry about the oil from the makeup. I just do my lace tint. Thank you. Y'all, my eyes is bad. I'm trying to read the comments. I got my my sister. She in here helping me. I can't. I can't see. I gotta go get some contacts. I got some glasses, but I can see. I can't see y'all name. It's so little. Y'all, I love my hair. Baby, my hair is getting long. I don't know. I shouldn't have shaved my hair. Y'all know my hair. I got me a I got some hair loss. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. Y'all know my hair is getting long. I shaved my hair off last year, so I'm growing back. It's it's dropping down there. I'm going to style it for y'all when I get my styling. Pro I'm waiting on my styling products to come in so I can do some natural hairstyling. Because we're going to do some natural hairstyling, too. I'm I'm a uh, universal hairstylist. I don't just do one thing. That's something I didn't want to do because I wanted to teach. And I didn't want to focus on one thing because I get bored. I don't know how y'all don't get bored. Somebody was under the comments. They was like, Auntie, I don't like that hair. I'm like, girl, just look at the technique. 
ain't y'all bored? Everybody got the same hairstyle. Like, let's do something different. Let's have fun. Right? They don't be trying to do that, y'all. They be like, time to make the donut. Middle part. Side part. Girl. That's boring. Or I just, or it's, it's probably me. I get bored real quick. Like, I don't want to do that. They be like, Auntie, we didn't like the ramen noodles. I said I didn't like it either. Challenge yourself. See if you can make it look right. I don't know. Somebody might like it. I don't know. But I just be having fun. I just like hair. Right? And when you like hair, you're going to challenge yourself. Not just here, any job. Like, if you like what you do, you're going to challenge yourself to be better or do better or try to see if you can overcome something or make something better or, you know what I'm saying, make something easier. Look, girl, challenge yourself. Okay, so we back. All right, so we're not using alcohol, y'all. I done told y'all that a million times, but that's okay because sometimes we got new new nieces and nephews that show up that come over here and they be like, who is this? And then I be like, hey, I'm, I'm your auntie and I'm going to get you uh, together, baby. I'm going to help you out, show you some new techniques because that's what I do. So we're going to use, you can use some makeup wipes. They got all free uh, makeup wipes. You can use um, the micellar water. Where is it? You can use micellar water to clean your skin, but we don't want you using alcohol, guys. Alcohol is too harsh for the skin, okay? They be like, Auntie, I think I got a chemical burn. I'd be like, well, what you been using, niece? They say, oh, Auntie, um, I, I, took, I didn't clean my skin with alcohol, but I took my wig off with alcohol. So me, 20 years, 25 years in the game, I already know you scrape the rest of the glue off with the alcohol. Auntie already know. Don't you know how your mama, she be like, who did this? She already know how it went down, right? Because mama been living here longer than you, right? So they be like, auntie, I, I, I just took it off with the alcohol. So what did you get the rest of the glue off with, niece? They ain't going to say that part. So I know you didn't scrub your delicate face with that alcohol to get the rest of the glue off like you did the previous install. Now you on fire. That's exactly what happened. Because you know mama know what happened. All right. Now we back. We are going to where my cotton swab that I use this. Because I ain't got a lot of time. I ain't got a lot of time. I ain't got a lot of time. All right, so let me put this up here. Yeah, I keep been around on the block. Can't halfway tell the story, baby. I already know how it went down. I've been around the block for a long time. All right, so we're going to go in. Is that remover? No, that's remover. Oh, skin protect. All right, let's add that skin protect. All right, y'all. Okay, so check it out. So what we got here is our bowl hole skin protect. Hair, when when y'all, I know y'all, y'all looking online, you're like, oh, this is glue. We're gonna do a laser. Blah, blah, blah. It's it's more than just that. This is a system, okay? And ain't nobody just trying to sell you a package full of 10 products. This is a hair replacement system. Your hair and your um your scalp is gonna be covered up and can't breathe. It can't breathe, niece. It can't breathe, nephew. So guess what they created? Skin protect, okay? It's also going to make your wigs last longer. So this is what we're going to do. So we're going to take a little, um, I think I dropped this. And that's okay. We're going to spray this on here, okay? Then you're going to dab it on. Don't wipe it on. So dab, dab, dab. Actually, one to two um, layers of this will be just fine. You don't use alcohol at all on your skin, on your face, on your delicate, beautiful face, ever. I don't care what you heard. I don't care what you saw. Don't use that on your delicate, beautiful little face, okay? No alcohol. It's going to tear your skin up, and you're going to get a chemical burn after it's being... You See, if I do alcohol right here, 
I'm not putting nothing. I'm if I put alcohol on my skin and I don't cover it up, right? Listen to me. Follow me. Follow me. The damage that you did with that alcohol, the air is going to repair. You're, you're gonna your skin is gonna repair itself, right? But when I do that alcohol and I cover it up with with a wig, it can't breathe. So it's gonna burn. Okay, it can't even repair the skin. The skin automatically repairs itself, right? Especially after about uh, 72 hours, it starts repairing itself. But it can't repair itself if it can't get air. Give me an auntie, I got a chemical burn. I already know what happened. Mama already know how it happened. Okay, I didn't just fall off a tank truck. All right, we ready. So this is going to be the wig that we are giving away. All right, I'm going to show you guys a quick way to uh, achieve this color pattern. I uh, actually come up with an easy way for y'all to do this. You don't got to um, you don't got to use foil if you don't want to. I'm going to show y'all an easy way to do this. I already recorded it. Okay, so so the lace on this is already cut because I was showing somebody how to um, how to put this wig on, right? Photo. The lace is already cut on this wig. This is the wig I'm giving away. We just colored this the other day, and I was giving somebody a quick little class, a quick little application class, and we did it with this one, and I already cut the lace. But this is the wig we're giving away, and it is from, let me tell y'all the company again. It is from I Define Natural, okay? All right. The color, the coloring, it, it didn't give me a hard time with coloring. I will say that. I can't tell you what the hair going to do. I can't tell you nothing. But when I give it away to somebody, they going to tell us what the hair do. Okay? Because I'm just going to do my boho application. Okay. All right. So you want to try to place it. Since the lace is already cut. Let me get some foot. Since the lace is already cut. You want to try to position it where, you know, it looks most natural to you. And I'm going to kind of like, I'm going to pin these out the way. So we can apply this wig. I'm going to show y'all. Y'all going to be like, I got an easy way for y'all to color this. Even if you don't win, I'm going to show y'all how to achieve this color. Super easy. And it almost is giving a balayage effect, but we're not going to balayage it because i know that sometimes even with me when i first started uh hair school and coloring hair that was one of the hardest things for me so i had to find like easy ways to do something is it no you didn't have to pluck it i'm sorry i, I do need to uh get up close so y'all can see that i didn't have to pluck this week sorry about that yeah that was a good thing about it too i didn't have to pluck it i, I didn't have to bleach it so the color is a custom color i'm gonna show y'all i'm gonna upload it on my youtube so the wig, y'all know, y'all know I'm I'm 50 years old. I don't know how to do this. I just started doing this stuff. So yeah, you need the wig description. I need to make sure we put that on there, Chauncey. So the wig is what's the inches? I'm gonna tell y'all what it is. I'll put it in the description, y'all. But I want to at least tell you what length it was. It's a 13 by 6. I'm gonna show y'all the inside real quick. It's the inch. I have my assistant. I have her put it on YouTube. Okay, so, but this is the wig we're giving away. I'm going to show y'all the inside of it. Since the lace is already cut, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take my white eyeliner and I'm going to draw it out where, I, where I'm going to put the glue. Now, I prefer to cut my lace first, y'all, because I can't see with all that in my face. It just be too much going on for me. If you don't prefer to do yours that way, I don't feel like it, it hurts if you don't cut it, I, I, you know. But I did notice, like, when I'm doing cheaper hair, I have to um, leave the lace on. Like a, a cheap brand. Like, sometimes I've ordered hair just from random vendors just to see what's what. And uh, the cheaper quality or lower quality, I noticed that it did better when I did not um, cut the lace. That's just something I noticed. But yeah. All right. So 
this has a um a deep parting it's a 13 by 6 so it goes like you have a lot of parting space so that was pretty good now i'm gonna go ahead and apply my glue since i already know where my where everything is going right we can see it right here big old head girl okay so i got all the space in the world to add glue i don't have to worry about getting glue on my hair but i do teach y'all what to do if you have a low hairline you have to catch that on my youtube i show you about using the bow hole lace tape to keep from um putting glue on your hair okay i show y'all those uh tricks but this is the week that we're giving away all right all right so the way that i do it you can either put a dot on your face or you can use the spatula to do it. it's up to you but I don't, one thing I don't do, guys, I don't put a bunch of dots across my face because I don't want to use too much glue, okay? If you use too much glue, your wig is going to slide, all right? So this, right, when I do it like this, this keeps me from using too much glue. You see, that was one dot. You see how far I got with one dot? And this is something I've been trying to explain to y'all. Imagine me putting a bunch of dots across my face. And you see how far I got with just one? Watch this. Okay, the thinner that layer is, the better your your the tighter hold you're gonna have. And and people who do it like this, they'll tell you that is is so true. The the wig is gonna be so tight. Something is just something that is inside. You know, some people here telling them the more glue they use, the tighter it's gonna be. Your wig gonna slide. It can't cure properly, and it takes. 24 hours to cure with uh, white water-based glues. Now, with the silicone glue that we have, it don't take that long. Just a few hours to cure. But then, too, that glue ain't for everybody. Like myself, I, I don't like to keep my wig on that long. I wear it for fun. And I teach proper uh, wig application. This is just one, one drop. And y'all, look, this bottle of glue is so little. The components that it takes to make it is, it is expensive when it's not counterfeit, right? When it's not coming from Asia, right? So the count, the, the components that it takes to make that small bottle, the reason why it's so small, that the glue is expensive. I mean, the ingredients. So... Y'all using too much glue. A lot of people are using too much glue and they don't know it because they see every day is, you know, we live in a monkey see monkey do world. So when you see Juju using half of her bottle of glue, you think that's what you're supposed to do because her outcome, it looks so good. All right. So after that first layer, I'm going to wipe my white dots off. I'm going to wipe my white dots off because now I know where my next layer is going to go. I'm only going to do two layers because I have to do another application tomorrow. So I'm not trying to do too much. And to me, I just feel like that's easier. Now, y'all notice, Auntie didn't use no blow dryer. For y'all that's new here, I ain't use no blow dryer, but... My glue is clear. I didn't even need a blow dryer. You know why they need a blow dryer, knees? The glue too thick. That's why they need a blow dryer. Okay, they need a blow dryer because they're using entirely too much glue. But we already clear. So let's go ahead and do this next layer. Get it nice and flat. If you hot while you applying glue, the glue will take longer to dry. So if you know this, you do it like, I'm going to give you some examples. Like me, I'm 50, right? So I have hot flashes, right? So give me some water to drink before you start putting that glue on me. Even if I don't, even if I ain't thirsty. Tell her she look thirsty. Here goes some ice cold water. Uh, sometimes um, if you got a little extra jiggle in your wiggle, you might be hot. Okay. So just give us some water. Even if she says she don't want to, just give it to her. 
please drink this. This is going to help. This is water. I'll give you the science on this. It's water based and it's pH balance. It's, it affect your pH balance affects the water based blue. Okay, it's water based. People be like, what's in it? It's watered down plastic. Just to sum it up, so that chemical burn came from alcohol. Okay, alcohol hairspray and alcohol. Okay. We only gonna do two later, y'all, because I gotta put another wig on tomorrow. We're gonna do the silicone tomorrow because we we missed a week. I was out um working on some other projects, so we missed we gotta do that silicone and get in the water with that silicone. We'll get in the water with uh this after too. You know, I like to do all of them. She already getting clear, no blow dryer. No nothing. And it's going to be tight. Y'all got to trust me. Y'all got to trust your auntie. What can someone do before applying glue if they break out from all glue? A lot of times, I'm going to tell you something. A lot of times, that breakout is coming from what you uh, do to your hair, um, do to your, um, what you applying on there, like, Makeup. Makeup is a breathing ground for bacteria. Are you using makeup when you're doing these installs? So, you know, when you close it up with that lace, it can't breathe. So it's just moist under there with that makeup. So you will break out. And sometimes if you know your skin is real funny, you can't wear your wigs that long. It just is what it is. The wig description. I guess I could be reading that while I'm waiting on this, huh? Okay, so they sent me this. Okay, 13 by 6. Where is the length? I promise I'm I'm blind, but I'm not that blind. I don't see the length. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's 22 inches. It's 180 density. It's silky straight. And it's called Lila Super Glueless Straight. That's what she's called. Her name is Lila. I'll put all that in the uh, caption on my um, on my YouTube. Knots already bleached. Super thin HD. Hey, Lila. Lila's cute. I got a little something on her um, on her lace. We about to put her on as soon as we clear. We about clear. A couple little pieces. I did not tint the lace. I'm gonna spray it one time because I did notice it was a little light. All right, so I'm gonna go in with the uh, lace tint. Usually I'll I'll tint it afterwards, but I got my makeup on. I gotta go somewhere. I don't wanna mess up my makeup. So I'm gonna just do a light spray. If I need more, I'll use a um. I use a brush. The cap that I have on is the Boho HD cap. You can get it on our website. They like $2.50. Or you can get a bundle deal. So I just did a light spray of the lace tint on there. But generally, I like to do it afterwards. Yep, it's a 13 by 6. It's 22 inches. It colored with no problem, but the suggested uh, instruction said don't go up too light for this one. What is wrong with my camera? Oh, there we go. <laughs> okay, so I think we are dry and we're ready to apply. All right, so 
super easy, right? All you got to do is line it up with where you say you go, where you put the glue. To me, this is easier than me um, doing the, um, leaving the lace on. I just feel like I can see, but that's just me. If it worked better for you to leave your lace on, but like I said, I had actually cut this because I like to cut my lace on, on my live too, because so y'all can see like how far I'll be cutting the lace. But uh, I had did a demonstration with someone earlier so we had cut the lace with her but y'all know I, i'm always on here doing it as much as i can so y'all will see me do it too okay so this is key too like if you have some extra little spots you can go back and add glue there if you feel like the lace is still too light, you can go on top and add um, more tint. I'm going to add a little. Uh, I might do. I'm not doing baby hair. I'm just going to use my lace jelly. I like baby hair on curly hair, but that's just me. So I did have a little piece right here. Not much. I'm going to just swipe that down. And then let it dry. Don't take long. This is how you get the glue off the lace. I actually have a YouTube on that. If y'all apply the glue the way that I'm showing you, your glue gonna come off easy. But I'm telling you, when I, I see people, I still see people laying their lace down on, on the glue while it's white. That makes it hard to get the glue off. Okay? Because I think I heard somebody's reasoning behind that. They were saying that um, they did it because they were hiding the grids. If you lay the um the lace down while the glue is white, it's gonna make it hard to clean. Okay. All right. So at this point right here, I'm gonna dry it with a cold blow dryer because this is a uh, water-based glue. I already explained to my nieces and nephews that white water-based glue is um uh, it will the um your heat from your body will affect the glue. So we don't want to use heat on water-based glue, okay? Cold air. I know y'all been told all kind of stuff. No, it don't roll right up. Your uh, layers are not right, but we'll help you apply. So just, um, we do, we have FaceTime assistance with our products. If you email us at info at the hair diagram, we'll make sure your layers are right, okay? So what I like to do, I don't care what they say. They be like uh, taking this cone. What they do? They take the cone and they do like this. You can do that if you want to, but if you really want your wig to be have a nice hole, put it on cone and press this in until you don't feel nothing sticky. Press it in. Listen to me. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me until you don't feel nothing, nothing sticky. Okay. Then you do the other side. Same thing. Press it in. You got to trust it. When the glue is dry. You probably let it dry too long, but like I said, email us and we'll do a FaceTime with you and make sure you get it perfect. Okay? If you let the glue uh, stay dry too long, yeah, it loses it. That's what's up, Shaquez. I have it on cold air because you don't want to ever use heat on water-based glue ever. And if you go read any instructions on any glue, it has specific temperatures. Thank you for the love. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so let me get my makeup brush. I feel like I need to, y'all know I like to zoom in. So that, that's going to be hiding. All right. So I like to comb out the little hairs that I might have got. Comb that back. Comb this back. I didn't tweeze it. I didn't do anything to this. I probably could have, but 
I just feel like that wasn't gonna give you like no review because I probably would have went in here and tweet. I don't know. It ain't even bad. So let me shut up. It ain't bad. I didn't do anything to it. I'm just combing this. Got a couple little hairs, but I can see a little something here. Um, it ain't bad. I sprayed it pretty good. I probably would have tweet somewhere up in there. Let me see this. Oh, that's hair. Y'all, I can't see. I'm going to just do it if, just for GP. So it's it's human hair. But I do, I see a little cast right here. It's not bad, but I'm I'm real particular sometimes. And then I got somewhere to go, so I'm trying to be cute. So I'm going to go in here with my brush, right? Not a lot. So let's wipe some of it off with my uh, lace tint. I don't, I'm not trying to flood my hair wet, even though I dried it. I just want to color it a little bit. Like, I don't know if y'all can see that, but I can see it in my mirror. Okay. I, I don't think y'all can see it though. So you, I don't have it soaking wet. Do you, you notice the difference? Like just that fast? Like I'm just, maybe I'm just real kind of like picky. Cause like, I like to be close to people and they be standing and be like, yeah, yeah, this is my hair. So I'm just a little particular. It wasn't bad, but I just do that anyway. And then I go back and dry it. I don't really, I try to my best to get away from the makeup guys. Once I learn, you know, what I know about the makeup. Can you make a stylist, a lace tip package? I got you. Can you DM me, uh, Michael? I, oh, I, I know I said your name, bro. Give me. I got some for you. Yep, it comes in four different shades. We got dark brown, medium brown, and light brown, and the caramel. All right, so now, uh, y'all know, Auntie, I'm. <laughs> it feels so funny, like, for real, for real. This year, y'all know I'm 50, so I'm not going to do no baby hair unless I got curly hair. I'm about to go on top with my lace jelly. Okay, this wig is going to be a part of the giveaway. Let me put the lace jelly up here to get the products. If you having issues getting the products from TikTok, guys, you can always go on um, our website and get the products. We got free shipping on the website, too. We ship fast. I got a really good team. It's not letting me add. Let me see. On a pen. I'm trying to add the jelly. Okay, it's on there now. The jelly is $9.99. The good thing about this jelly, no alcohol. Okay, so what I tried to do, I didn't, you know, when, I, when I'm when i doing stuff and I'm creating product, and I also help my students create product too. In my uh, product creation, I was not trying to make a, a got to be, right? I was trying to make something safer. Okay, the got to be has uh, other items in it that is for hair so it has alcohol in it and that's not something that i want to put on my skin that's not something that i want to sell just to be selling okay so i want to make sure that i'm selling stuff that is you know great for your skin but it's about it's a, a lot of times it's got a lot to do with what y'all use and what y'all doing to y'all skin too okay so i'm just going to take my uh lace jelly this lace jelly to me in my opinion i feel like it helps high degrees too so I kind of like take that along the hairline. I'm not doing baby hair, y'all. I'm just going to do this. And then I'm going to dry it one more time. And I'm going to be done. But this is just what I do to mine. Okay? This is just what I do to mine. And y'all can do the same thing if you want to. If you want to do baby hair, you can't. I got some baby hair tutorial. But I'll um the hair that I'm putting on with that silicone, I'll get my daughter to um, put my wig on for y'all and then have her do the baby hair. She better at baby hair than me. So we'll do that tomorrow. And that wig is going to be a giveaway soon. If I'm on time. <laughs> Y'all know I be behind. But I be trying to get in here the best I can. But I'm not doing baby hair, guys. Um, usually I would have cut this. I didn't get it. I didn't, I didn't do it. It's okay. But I didn't cut it. Okay, so now I want to go ahead and dry this with cool air. Y'all, don't... Uh, I see people... It's up to you. But for me, I'd rather dry it before I tie it down. Okay? 
But that's just me. You can do baby hair. I'm going to have my, uh, yeah, it's more fitting for me. Thank you. I'm going to have my daughter do that with the curly hair, though, because I don't mind the baby hair with the curly hair. I don't know what time. I got a um I got a new page too for my uh my DIYs. I got um uh, I got a little construction going on on one of my um one of my homes. So I don't know. When I'm done meeting with them, then I can get on live. It says, what if you sweat? Is water made still good? The application. It's the application. That's why. That's why y'all always see me go live, and I wet it on live. But I would have had to do more layers. I would have to do. But I usually do four layers, if three to four layers, if I know I'm gonna wet this for y'all. I'm gonna I'm gonna wet this one for y'all. But I only need two. I'm gonna do it again. It's it's the application. If you're gonna get this acid wet, you gotta apply it right. You gotta apply it right. But that silicone, we got to do that tomorrow because I, I have to knock out that silicone. So we we kind of skipped that um, a week ago. It says, do you do this for medical uh, insurance clients? So I actually teach, um, I actually have someone that teaches that. I have two of my students teach the medical billing for wigs. When you take my class, I do give you that information. And some of them is on my page anyway. I think I posted them. Let me get my band. I really don't be putting on no band, y'all. I ain't gonna even lie, but the band will kind of like help mold it down too. But I only do that band after I've dried it. So at this point, and I'm gonna uh, load the video showing you guys how to uh, get this easy um, the placement. Super easy. You don't have to be a hairstyle. I'm gonna show y'all the placement on this. It was super quick. I got a, a quick little method for y'all to show y'all how to get this um this this color in here without uh messing it up and like if you slow when it comes to color because some people slow when they're using the bleach and stuff like that and it kind of like messes them up but I, I got a trick for y'all with this right here i got a trick for y'all to show y'all how to get this color i'm gonna load it i just need to finish editing it i had to put this on so that i could do my intro outro for the video and then i'm gonna load it on my youtube it's gonna be super quick. I'm gonna do a short uh, clip for my um, for my social so y'all can see like how it's done too. You took Tony Love. Tony Love is the bomb. All right, so this is it, y'all, and I'm gonna show y'all how to do this. Tony is everything. So that's pretty much all I do when I do my applications, y'all. Sometimes I don't even put that band on. But if I do Swiss lace, I'm definitely going to put that band on, make sure I push it into that glue. But for this HD lace, I don't really have to worry about it. But y'all, this is going to be the giveaway wig. I tried to zoom in over there. This is going to be the giveaway wig. Let me explain to y'all. So what I've been doing is this wig is from I Define Natural. I don't know them. And I'm taking this wig off as soon as I get from the Dave Chappelle show. I don't know these people. I'm taking this wig off tonight. I'm going to wash it up and get it ready to give it away to one of my nieces and nephews. Okay? I don't know these people. I'm taking the wig off. But I, I do. I come on here to show y'all techniques, show y'all how to do different things, show y'all and share with y'all what I know. And I know that some of these companies, it's a little fickle. It's a little funny out here. So I'm not about to be like pushing nobody's wigs. I don't know how they customer service is. I don't know how the wig is because I'm taking it off. So I'm going to give it away to one of y'all. And all y'all have to do is text me at 786-590-0692. If you're on YouTube, uh, Facebook, I'm going to make sure I put it in the description. It's random. We randomly pick you. If you've already texted me before, I just need you to text me your email. But if you've already texted me before, you don't got to do that. All you got to do is text me. The description, just describe this wig however you want to describe it. I'm going to know it's you. I'm going to know it's you because I know my nieces and nephews. Okay? I know you. I know you, know you, know you because you already saved in my phone. So all that's all y'all got to do. If you've already texted me before, just text me a description of this wig. Okay? And I'm going to put all everything on my YouTube. I'm going to load everything on there y'all but this was 
the look and she's cute and i'm gonna show y'all how to do this even if you don't win i'm gonna show y'all even if you're a hairstyles or upcoming hairstyles or whatever i'm gonna show y'all how to get this like in 45 minutes i'm gonna show y'all how to get it and it looks perfect it looked like you took the time it looked like you fought it it looked like you weaved it or it looked like you balayaged it i'm gonna show you what to do to make you cute it's like your auntie all right y'all all right i gotta get out of here i got places to be people to see all right youtube I forgot to put the number in here, but I'm going to put it in the description. If y'all are new to my uh, channel, or you can get the number off of one of the old videos. So I'm going to uh, put it in. I have my um, my assistant to put the phone number in the description box. Anybody can enter. We're going to be doing these constantly because uh, I used to wouldn't. And people used to get mad at me. They're like, why won't you tell us where you got the wig? Because I'm trying to save you some money because the wig is trash. Right? But y'all don't want to hear that. People don't, y'all not used to people telling being honest with y'all. Y'all used to people lying and just being slick and getting, they getting the money for to, to review the wig. Then they I see them, they get the wig free. Then they sell it to y'all. But everybody's different. I'm giving it away. Y'all can review the wig for me. Okay. So that's all I got, y'all. I will see y'all tomorrow.